Hello and welcome to the channel. Welcome back to the channel with Cherry Today Chat, who is alive with me right here. Say hello. Uh, this is the virtuous. Hang on. This is the virtuous. Oh my god. This is the virtuous album listening party, guys. As I just told the chat, I have waited over a day for these B-sides. I, of course, checked out just this when it dropped, and uh, for anybody that didn't see it, I surprisingly, literally surprisingly, cried my eyes out. And I'll explain, I'll explain why. I know all about that song when we get to it. That's the only song I've heard from this album. I have not heard the intro we're about to check out. Um, so, yeah. I don't know if I'm ready. Never am. There's been a lot of the, my, my Discord has been teasing me when it comes to this album in a nice way. I still can't believe what I'm witnessing with this alone. A three minute, 55 intro. Now I always say with Dreamcatcher intros, they are absolutely phenomenal. The producers are beasts. And I, and I think I'm not the only person that's always, that's thought this, that I'm like, oh, it'd be great if these intros were a bit longer. It'd be great if these intros were like full songs. This is three minutes, 55. Three minutes, 55. The Winter just said, when the, when the intro is longer than the title track, that's insane. I actually talked to my Discord earlier, guys, because of course I'm doing the ultimate uh, Dreamcatcher ranking for him, but it doesn't know where I go from beginning of the beginning of their discography to their most recent, uh, ranking the songs as I go into most favorite to least favorite. And um, I actually, I had, actually had to ask about this when hearing about the length of it, because I normally don't rank intros, interludes, or outros because of the length of them most of the time. And I was like, oh my god, is this going to be a future ranking? Which will be a first, like an intro has never been in a ranking series. And the answer would be no. And let me tell you why. Um, that I'm going to totally guess that this is mostly the producer's work. And this is going to be mostly an instrumental. Um, now, if the ladies themselves were playing the instruments, there may be an argument there. Um, but I'm not going to rank this. But if you're curious about intro rankings when it comes to Dreamcatcher, stay tuned. Stay tuned. Um... Megan, I, I heard that the Bruces uh, from 80s are the ones for this Dreamcatcher. Oh, oh yeah, they, they, they've they been around for um, since pretty much the beginning, Megan, I, uh, the producers from 80s. Uh, Leeson Olander, I think. Was it Lee's or Olander who's not longer, no longer producing with uh, Dreamcatcher? I can't remember. Uh, Silver, Silver Fist, the intro is immaculate. I kind of wish we got an outro for this album too. Uh, I'm going to say this as well, guys. Um, these intros are made to go straight into the title track. I am going to be, I won't be talking about this intro until after we check out Justice. I'm going to literally let this play into the into Justice because I want full experience and everything like that, you know? Um, so, right. Here we go. This is intro seven. That was like Final Fantasy, that intro, and I mean that as a big plus. Stream, folks. The way this is building. Guys, in America. America Insomnia, you realize that they're going to come out to this. 
when you see them in November, right? I am so jealous. Congratulations, Silverfest. Who's got, let me know chat, who's got tickets? This is a masterpiece of intro, by the way. It's like a journey in itself. close to tearing up, which I think is just going to be a running theme with this album. This, honestly guys, this reminds me with the melody so much of a Final Fantasy soundtrack and that is a humongous positive and compliment to the producers. I'm going to be talking about that after after justice guys but as i said i'm going to let it go straight into justice so that we get the full effect oh my god it's just this i just realized <laughs> oh my god i'm not ready for to listen to this for the 57th time in two days Oh, 
Oh, she swam. Anybody got a cigarette? Oh, Weasdale, we are checking many different versions of this song. Don't you worry about that. Don't you worry about that. Like that, but I'm not going to that just yet. Not just yet, I said. Oh. Right, let me first talk about the intro. That It's kind of... It's kind of an advantage that the intro is the longest by it's double the length of like their intros, maybe more. Um, any of their other intros, it's kind of like an advantage it has. That's the best intro the Dreamcatcher have done. Um, but again, it has that advantage of being a bit longer, so it has that time to like. Even though I love the other intros they've done, it has that time to tell that story, to build it up. It built it up so beautifully, starting slowly, adding instruments now and again. Again, the biggest compliment I can give that is that it gave me. It was like Final Fantasy with guitars and drums and bass. Um, as far as like the melodies that were going on with the soundtrack and everything like that, just pure beauty. Do you know what I mean? Just absolute pure beauty. And I and I went f like that's the first thing you hear in this album. And like from the beginning of that intro to the end of that intro, I already feel like I've been on a massive journey. And then Justice slaps you in the face. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Justice just whoo, slaps you in the face. Incredible intro. Absolutely incredible intro. I, I, I will never be, not that I ever skip intros anyway, but I will be looking out for that intro, if that makes any sense. Right, what's the chat said? Did you, did you guys lose your mind listening to that again? I have a bit of a statement for that song that I'll say in a, in a moment that some people may know. Uh, winter, chill, winter chills, oh my, oh my dear God, give us strength to get through this MV alive. Uh, Andrea, this song hits me in the feels and gives me goosebumps every time I listen to it. Perfectly said. That's a special song that can give like like the I, I keep on saying the ultimate goosebumps for me is is me starting starting to cry, and it's not because the song is emotional because it's like super sad or something like that. It's just so uplifting and epic that it, I can't help it. It's it's an incredible feeling. Um, Matt Alhania, are you going to change the pick in the low right? No, I am not because we do already have Dreamcatcher representation, which is above me there, Matt Alhania. Um, the lady herself, God, it's so good. Imagine Zane, uh, Weasdale. I feel, I feel like this intro is meant to represent the producers and especially Outlander, Outlander's uh, perspective on Dreamcatcher as a project and team. Winter chills. We build a barrier. Yes, we do. Is we build a barrier going to be the new holding this pain? Maybe, maybe. Um, and also the album, but more than that, uh, says Weasdale. Uh, Silver Fist, this is a safety check for Dammy Stans. Are you okay between this MV? And the two rings showcase, showcase, which, by the way, that's on you too. I've not checked any of the showcase guys, like the B-sides, by the way. Not checked anything out, so this will be the first time checking out too. Um, it keeps hitting the same, Ladvaris, oh my god, uh, 100%. Um, Andrea, uh, this this song is so emotional and it's a masterpiece. Mahalania, simply Yu Yon, which I love, guys, <laughs> with the MV. Do you don't see any of Yu Yon without glasses for that shot? And it's it's almost like you're like why 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 is she in glasses? But it's 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 a science. Do you know what I mean? Um, uh, Weasdale is Ross going to watch any of the showcase yet? So yeah, I will be. I will not be checking out the dance practice for justice because I'm going to save that for when we get to it in the ranking episode uh, down the line. But the showcase I'm checking out. Um, my various go for it, guy. And yeah, guys, if you if you see my if you saw my initial reaction. Um, I haven't watched it back or anything like I don't really like to watch my reactions back or anything like that. But like, I remember that when that last chorus hit after the bridge, you see me almost like, hang on. You see me almost like, I'm in shock at the fact that Guyon is doing the belt. And I've always said how proud I am of Guyon when she gets those opportunities to show how, ama how much of an amazing singer she is. And you see me go, oh my God, Guyon's doing the belt. And then within a split second, I'm realizing what Shion is doing in the back. Oh, my God. Um, uh, 
I've lost, lost right words with, words with the chat just talking about this song. Um, Silver Fist, the hoop, super high ad lib, hot damn, winter chills. Oh, I hope I said that right. Uh, Zane, every time that chorus hits, it's like an explosion. Uh, Ladvarius, the all vocal version is going to kill us more. Uh, Weasdale, excellent. Uh, Andrea, I do not envy the ranking of this song right now and the outfits. They rock the visual as this comeback. I do have something to say, and I may as well say it now that you've um, brought that up, Andrea. Oh, do I say this now? I don't like to think too much, guys, on where songs could go, even if I've heard them when it comes to rankings. But let me tell you now, I can't believe that this song is actually going to make me potentially think if it's going to go above a certain other song. Let me just say that for now. Uh, Silver Fist, uh, guy unimpressed the crap out of me vocally this comeback. She's always been good, but it's just leveled up. Yeah, I saw this amazing comment on the video on the MV, and it was like uh, the producer saying, who wants the high note for this song? Dreamcatcher. Yes. <laughs> um, uh, Lucy, uh, oh God, you're doing the showcase too. Yep. Um, I'm, like I said, it's a stream today, guys. Uh, Zane, same. I feel like Rising was a test run for doing a title like this, and they absolutely ate up. Ooh, that's an interesting point, uh, Zane. By the way, Ryzen, oh, Ryzen's a song. Um, Lavarius Ryzen gave me chills, uh, just it gives me, gives me chills, too much chills. Um, winter chills, we build the barriers, like wind blows. Uh, out of nowhere glasses, yeah, it's just like, out of nowhere she's there in glasses, and like, it's like none of us are like, what? Uh, oh, what? No, we, we're good with it, you, Jan. If you want to be in glasses more often, that's completely fine with me. Uh, Meg and I, I hope, I hope they get to perform justice at war shows. Uh, I don't know what stage it would be so good. Silver Fist, I don't like to watch my reactions back. Same, though. I uh, love various hot news from Twitter today. Justice was the second most viewed K-pop MV on YouTube with 3.9 um, uh, million views. That's incredible. I think it's on like 6 million plus now, is it? I didn't see that. Uh, I was too preoccupied by what was going on. Um, Chin Chin, hello. Uh, won the K release. Uh, dance ear performance totally live with all detail of sound. I have got that, I thought, as well. I didn't put that in. I will be putting that in, guys. Because I wanted to check that out. So I will be. Let me use this. It was, um... Yeah, I, I, that, that was supposed to be in the playlist. That was actually supposed to be in the playlist, so let me do that now. Yeah, this is it. This is where I want... Yeah, this was supposed to be in the playlist. Thank you! Thank you, Chin Chin, for reminding me of that. This was supposed to be in here as well. I don't know if... Uh, this might need to be a, uh... A Patreon exclusive, guys, because I don't know uh, how they are with uh, YouTube reactions when it comes to this sort of stuff. The showcase will be fine, because it's on uh, Dreamcatcher's channel and everything, I know. Um, but, yeah, right, so let me just refresh that so there are ads to it. And uh, I'll check the showcase out first, then, then I'll be going to that. But, yeah, guys, I think that's um, possibly the best, in my opinion the best chorus I've ever heard in a K-pop song. And again, I'm not a recency bias guy, guy, guys. I'm not a recency bias guy. So when I tell you how highly I regard this song from the off, I'm not saying it lightly. I'm not saying lightly. When Bon Voyage came out, I was like, oh, this is really good, but I wasn't like so much other people who were like, this is the second coming of Deja Vu. In my opinion, this may be the second coming of Deja Vu, though. Um, I suggest you listen to that. Yeah, yeah. Thank you again for letting me know about that, Chin Chin. Um, so 6.3 million now. Awesome stuff. Uh, very excited for, for that uh, dance here one. Uh, yes, that's where the info came from. Dreamcatcher data account. Prep for Dammy, Daniel. Uh, one thing, though, guys, I wanted to check. And this is from Winter Chills. Uh, Winter Chills should be somewhere in the chat. Winter Chills made a very quick uh, YouTube shot that I wanted to check out. So this is from Winter. It's called Why Justice's Chorus Sounds So Familiar. Winter Chills, have you got a new YouTube account? Because this isn't your YouTube account, is it? Have you changed the name? Because I'm, I'm subscribed to you, Winter Chills. But it says I'm not here. So yeah, Winter Chills, you let me know. You let me know, but I'll subscribe anyway. Um, right. So yeah, let's see. Oh, oh, sorry, I can't make full screen. Take 
second coming of Deja Vu. Second coming of Deja Vu. This is the second coming of Deja Vu, folks. This is the second coming of Deja Vu. Uh, oh, I'm jumping there. Sorry. Um, right, where were we? Okay. Um, so, right, showcase time. And, of course, I know, guys, obviously, Chian, uh, you may see in the chat, like I've said, that there's, like, the support link that I talked about in my reaction for Xi'an. Uh, that might be popping up in the uh, in the chat there. Uh, so I know she's not going to be here for this, obviously. I thought the same thing's finally a success, Akara says. It is what it is, guys. It is what it is. Sometimes we all just know. Sometimes we all just know. Oh no, Winter Chills, Mr. Yeah, Winter Chills, I asked. Have you changed your YouTube name? Or do you do have two YouTube accounts? Because I thought I was subscribed to you. Um, Silverfist, the MV of Justice has a ton of parallels to Deja Vu 2. I think the eighth person at the end of the MV might be Deja Vu. GU creating a multiverse. Whoa, whoa. That's some heavy lore. I'm not great with Dream, Dreamcatcher lore, guys, I won't lie. I, um, I'm not great with it. I leave that to the experts, but that's some crazy lore. Um, but I, I have heard people talk about that shot of like uh, Yu Yun and Han Dong, uh, and you see the crown at the end is similar to uh, to um, Deja Vu and the and the the throne and everything, right? Uh, Winter Chills. That channel was my previous try at a, a K-pop channel, but I abandoned it. I logged back. Oh, okay, sweet, okay, okay, okay. It's a good name, the Winter Chills. You know what I mean, right? So. I, you guys have told me, because of the, the Xion factor, what may happen here, but I can't wait to hear how it's going to be done. Because Xion is my favourite female singer in K-pop. Favourite female, female singer of all time. So filling in for her parts is going to be interesting, but if anybody could do it, these other six can. So here we go, showcase version. I will be simping. This is the first time seeing the car. Seeing the cook. Seeing the cook. The choreography. Cho choreography in full. Of course, go on, Sua. Seven singers, folks. Seven singers, folks. Blue hand on as well. Blue, blue. I don't think I've ever been more in love with her than I am right now. Did you hear that? Oh, you on. Okay, what on earth is gonna happen with this final chorus?
Why does this song constantly make me cry? Oh my god, the amount of times I've said seven, seven singers on this channel. This song, guys, is if you if oh. if you want to if anybody's got you in an argument, you know, on Dreamcatcher and vocals, just show them just this dude. And just show them that showcase. Show them the Justice MV first. Show them the showcase afterwards. Because you guys mentioned in the Discord how Handong and Sua were going to pick up for Xion. And the thing is, right, Sua I know. Sua's an ace, guys. I've said before. When I think of ace in K-pop, she's the person that comes to my mind first. Believe it or not. I think she's stupidly multi-talented. Sua. Still, to do what she did there at the end. It's... They're, they're way too OP, dude. I know I'm talking about my old group. The bias is going to be there and everything. They're too, they're too overpowered. They're too overpowered. I'm sorry. But let me say... I'm holding some pain. Because god... Damn, Handong. I didn't know what part Handong was going to pick up, but I know of course there's going to be some sort of part with Xi'an. I've never heard Handong belt like that. Can we get more Handong belt, please? Anyone? Producers? Can you just put like all of them doing belts on every song from now on? I'd, I'd, I'd personally love that. Oh my god, dude. Right, chat. I, uh, hopefully the chat's still alive. Um, I can't put... Uh, oh, by the way, yeah. Oh, I'll, I'll be talking. Yeah, give me a second. Right. Um, chin Chin. Uh, live without Xi'an power vocal lack of something. So we're taking over Xi'an power. Do it with uh, Guy Ong. Sound, uh, sound, a, uh, sound a orc? Sound a orc? I'm not sure what you're saying there, Chin Chin. Uh, Winter Chills, oh boy, you're going to be stunned at how uh, they will sing her part of Winter Chills. You were predicting the future right there. Uh, like various words, Handong, Winter Chills, Silver Fizz, check out all those tattoos. Yeah, the, the, I noticed that Dami had like um, like a t-shirt with sleeves that looked like tattoos and stuff like that, which was really cool. They, they, um, they looked, uh, they looked like Dreamcatcher. Uh, Andrea, uh, so they all rock their looks, they are vocal queens, Weasdale twitched, crashed just before the hand on for me. <laughs> of course it did. Um, Bike and Dami is needlessly hot, they are. And I don't think I've ever been more attracted to GU than when she was doing her belts. I, 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 mm, mm, mm -hmm. It was funny that when Reason came out, because I've heard Sewer belt before and everything like that, right? And Yu Yon. I've heard Yu Yon belt as well. Um, Yu Yon, by the way. Phew, Yu Yon's belt and belt. They're all, all their belts in this song. But, like, with Jiu, that was my first time with um, Reason hearing her do a proper belt. And I was just like, I remember hearing it for the first time and I was like, that's Jiu. Like, I'd, I'm so used to her not doing belts. So the fact that they've got her doing even more, because she can do it, folks. She can do it. She yeah, she's got that honey voice, but she can do it. They all can. They just dream catch a bra. Uh, chin chin. Uh, they hold in the note shot than I expected after we watch uh, Dancia. You know what I meant. Oh okay. Um, that varies the build up. Rossi face when Handong started to belt me my day. Man oh man, they did they did she on proud. Let me just say that. Uh, with the chill sewer on the top sewer. So, like I said, guys, when I think of Ace in K-pop, I think of Sua. Uh, Labrarius Peak Dreamcatcher, Weasdale, because it's great. Um, Andrea, it does that to me too, makes me cry. There's something about it. Honestly, guys, this song just keeps on, like, demanding tears out of me. It just wants to steal water from my body, like, do you know what I mean? Uh, Silver Fist, gonna hide for this one because I haven't seen it yet. Oh, no problem, to no, no problem at all, Silver Fist. Um, Lucy, uh, if you want to suffer a bit more, there's a member cam of that performance for all the girls on DC <laughs> You tell me there's a fan cam for all all six of them. Oh my god. Killing voice, I need it, imagine saying it. 
this is where I start to go into the topic of Dreamcatcher being still a little bit underappreciated. Like I, I, I said before, I was wrong by the way. I said before that they, I, I didn't think they'd been on Immortal Songs too. They had. I didn't realize that. Um, I think, I think Mama is a show that has groups that have won shows in the past, which Dreamcatcher now can do, by the way. And um, I have no clue why Dreamcatcher didn't do the Killing Voice a while back, let alone haven't done it yet, because they literally all kill with their voices. It's literally in the title, folks. It's literally in the title. Um, and I honestly think the Killing Voice, like I'm sure you guys agree, it's 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 a great way to get new fans for a group or an artist. I wouldn't have become a Mumu for my Mamu without the Killing Voice. The the Ultimate Mamu rank it would not exist without the Killing Voice. Um, the there's other ones too. Well, no, I was checking out certain things any anyway. Um, but like I fell in love with artists more because of the Killing Voice and everything, you know. Uh, hand on was surprising like various uh, don't even agree, don't even argue with anyone that would say anything negative about Dreamcatcher vocals yeah I mean it'd be a waste of breath really wouldn't it uh, Winter Chills wait until you hear Dami and the B-sides various my god this coming video is going to kill you Ross uh, Andrea these were incredible I watched everyone at least twice as well oh talking about the fan cams I'm guessing uh, Winter Chills the day we get a killing voice will be like the day of the first win honestly like the amount of people that are going to take notice when, uh, when, I'm being positive, not if, when, when Dreamcatcher do that killing voice, they'll just be like, oh, I've been sleeping like hell on Dreamcatcher, like, like many's do, like many's, many's do, like many do. Um, Mahalania, yes, that's another great example. Red Velvet. I really liked what I heard from Red Velvet, and then I, and then I checked out their killing voice, and I've been down that rabbit hole ever since, to the point that I chose to do a ranking for it, so that's a great example. Uh, right, okay, time to die again, guys, hope you're ready. Was this my third death? Yeah, I think it's my third death. Um, maybe I'm secretly a cat. Right, so this is dance ear performance. And I, I think this is like headphones needed for this, guys. So I don't know if anybody's uh, not wearing headphones at the moment. I'll give you 30 seconds to grab them. Because i got a feeling that's going to be one of these. Now, what it's, the headphones are needed for this. I'm going to take a guess. Uh, Ladvaris says yes. So I'll give, I'll give another 20 seconds for people to grab some headphones if they don't have them. If they have them available, of course. Because videos like this, um, I checked out some really cool ones from 80s and stuff too, where they have that sort of like, not that I don't, I don't know if this does, where it has that full surround sound. Um, but uh, when they implement sort of that sort of headphone technology, well, audio technology for headphones is really cool. A lot of people are warning me for this. It makes me very nervous. Insanely nervous, actually. How many people were warning me about this in the chat? Oh dear. People just keep on warning. Andrea, uh, two rings incredible, just as over the top masterpiece. Uh, Fireflies, another masterpiece. Stop, I'm so hype. Oh god, the B sides. We will get to them, guys. Um, but I told you, I told you, I warned you, there was going to be a lot of different versions of this I was going to be checking out because this song is an instant masterpiece. So, right, I'm preparing for death, I suppose. Oh, already, yeah, panning. Yeah, there you go, even the. Even. That. Oh my god, Shion's here as well? And Glass is you, young. Survive. Glass is Dami. Can you stop with the glasses? Oh, you can hear the footsteps too. Fire in 
The light dim presentation of this. The glasses. Show me what I'm looking for. Rebuild the barrier, build the barrier, build the barrier, find me. Yes, I'm a warrior, find me. Justice makes me fight. Fight. Justice makes me Show me what I'm looking for. Put on your mom, put in to Jim and Kudo Medal Natami, the Nicky Joma Vital Rit. You get a garden mug of gold and cake it with Tanya, or my heart is feeling like a nigga. Rebuild the barrier, put the barrier, put the barrier, find me. Yes, I'm a warrior, find me. Something to pause on, I suppose.
you guys warned me. You guys warned me. And it didn't do a lick. <laughs> I'll go to the chat first for that, because... At various, do you hear the vo do you he hear the vocals? <sighs> Malhalia yeah. glasses, yes, there were glasses, multiple pairs. Winter chills, there was absolutely no freaking reason they need to be in glasses, but now I can die happily. G U Belton, that's my response to that. Ross is now holding this pain. The stomping is so good, yes, yeah, Zane. I love the fact that the sound was including the stomps as well. <sighs> Andrea, just when you think the vocals can't get any better, they pull this out and shine even brighter. With the chills doing these bands. Belt while dancing their heart. Again, guys, this is one of those songs that if they just stood there singing, I'd be like, fair enough. For what you're going to do vocally, you stand there and sing. That's all we need. They were doing choreography with that. And they were doing that. And that choreography with those vocals. Are they human? Is my next question. Um, Andrea, it's, meanwhile, some GRP are struggling when live singing with light dancing. Um, imagine Zane, at the risk of repeating myself, killing voice, I need it. I want the chills. This, prob this probably is their best performance video after Boca Zombie Vision. I'm going to actually make a statement right here. This is their best performance video, in my opinion. The camera work, the light in. The use of the light in, in the musicality as far as the timing with the music, the fact that the, each burst of the flame went up with the belt and everything like that. The, the bursts went up with the belt and everything, you know, that was just mind-blowing to me. The set in as well with the steps is absolutely stunning. They look pretty good as well, I would say. Um, and then to have that final chorus when they have the, in the choreography, when they lift up like that and for the burst to go boom, boom boot in time with them lifting up that was that's their best performance video I've ever seen which I know is a statement from the off but I'm making very, lots of crazy statements but there's, there's just something about this damn song um, uh, Andrea uh, having this version with Sheehan is very much making me tear up yeah, oh, when I saw Sheehan was there as well I hope she knows the damage that she's done to all of us with what she's done in this song uh, imagine Zane Dammy singing sounds fantastic. Absolutely, that varies for those for those wondering. Ross's stream was not frozen. I was. By the way, where is she? Where is she? The, that lady, yes. Well, well, all of them, but there's one lady in particular. I'm and it's her. I don't know why it looks like it's filmed on a potato. Not no clue why. Let's hope my internet can take that. Although with the way it's been today, I'm not sure. It doesn't look like it can. Handong. 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 Oh my god. You guys weren't lying about, lying about how they look uh, in this. The best performance video went to chills. Uh, Lucy, uh, and I don't know if I'm alone, but it feels like Sheen is not going all out at all. <laughs> Which is crazy, isn't it? Like, if that's not her at full power with that song. As I said, American Insomnia. You, people living in the US that are going in November. I wish you the best of luck. This is so epic, says Latvarius. Uh, Andrea, epic feels like an understatement now, but I have no other words. It, this song is epic. K-pop in Utah! Hey, hey, dude. Uh, I came to witness the death of our dear Ross R.I.P. <laughs> you picked a great time. <laughs> you timed it really well. Um, with the chills, I feel like this had the same effect on you that uh, that 180s Wonderland performance. Oh, yeah, that was amazing. Chin chin, if Guy on holding the note a little bit longer, it would be the best of all. Uh, she on holding a half a second longer. I'll one line chin chin. I'm happy with what we got. I got no problem with what we got, honestly. Um, with the chills, yeah, I correct myself later. This is the best indeed. Uh, Kara, yes, I need a killing voice now. Oh my god, a dream catch a killing voice would be. 
Uh, chin Chin, uh, yeah, she does. She's working hard, we know. Uh, Weasdale, that's my girl. Secretaries assemble. <laughs> Just wait till you watch the Two Rings showcase for us. Handong is lethal. I am sick of them being lethal, guys. But that is the best performance video I've ever seen from Dreamcatcher, which is saying something, and... Woof, am I including special clips in that? I might do. I might be clearing that, that again. The setup of that, whoever directed that video, whoever directed that performance, well done, sir or madam, is what I'll say to that. Oh dear, well, have we did a day? Have we did over a day for this? I guess it's finally time to listen to these for the first time. B sides. As as I'm just going to remind you all. I don't check out highlight, highlight medleys. I have absolutely no Scooby-Doo what an, a second of this sounds like. This is Stomp. This has so much atmosphere to it, like Justice does. This pre-chorus. With it, with it, flow. No, no. I can't handle it doing this pre chorus. No. Oh god, these photos, my god, Jesus, man. God, these photos already. <sighs> See what the chat says. <sighs> right, um, it's like it's playing with our emotions, Weasdale. Uh, Winter Chills is probably my favorite of the B-sides. Chin Chin, uh, Ross, want to check out Two Ring? Don't watch the showcase because the camera didn't show their sexiness. Try to find another platform with a full view. Uh, Librarius, welcome to Dreamcatcher's best EP ever. Woo! That's a claim. That's a claim. Uh, K-pop and you say I hope one day so we'll choreograph this song. Uh, Winter Chills, uh, Two Rings is too good. I love them equally. 
<laughs> Winter Chills constantly second guessing. Uh, Kara loves um, Winter Chills. This is the Damien of this album. Uh, imagine that at a concert. Again, here's the thing, US Insomnias. I know, I know that we had a bit of bragging rights, right? Because we had Dreamcatcher come to the U come to Europe earlier this year. We had a bit of bragging rights and everything like that. You have the bragging rights now because you're going to hear all these songs live way before us. Congratulations, US. But seriously, congratulations. Um, Imagine Zane, Siren to you is best to you. Uh, Andrea, when I saw your reaction, uh, Lucifer, sorry, uh, when you saw re when I saw your reaction on news pre-chorus, I knew it was the end. <laughs> oh my God, that was it! Like Lucifer, that was it. That was it. I was like, this this you on pre-chorus is absolutely beautiful. I didn't even think what was going to happen with the second pre-chorus, and you put you put you put the alt on there, bro. You put the alt on there. that. By the way, well, I'll talk about the song in a second. Um, Lad various we French people are gonna stomp the hell out of the floor when they do it. Uh, imagine Zane Stomp is a League of Legends world song. It perfectly fits the vibe for one. Yes, good shout. Which is a big compliment, because as I said, guys, I've never played League of Legends, not really in a rush to. I love the show Arcane. Shout out to the show Arcane. Highly recommend it. But the music of League of Legends is mind blowing. Literally every song I've heard that's that's uh you know involved with League of Legends has been phenomenal and that did have I will say from the off before I go talk about that song in full cinematic vibes so you already know how I feel about it uh, Winter Chills in concert the floor gave in <laughs> um, uh, Winter Chills I personally recommend the showcase not a different one yeah you can watch a different one on your own time okay sweet um, that was incredible again as I just said in cin cinematic vibes, just like Justice had. A totally different song to Justice, of course, but what's great is that you can tell it's on the same release. I really appreciate that. It gives the EP an identity and everything, right? And uh, really, really appreciate that. Awesome drums. The, the, the band, the guitars and everything like that were incredible. Um, the song was like, as it went along, it was adding in little bits too. There was like a synthesizer that, well, of course, I'm going to pick that up. There was like a synthesizer that was coming out in like the last chorus. It's like it was constant, like I didn't know what was going to happen in the song. Um, not that it was experimental, it was like a, again, cinematic hype, like, rock, K-pop song and everything like that. Um, that's another gym song, by the way, just with Justice. Because I need something else. To, I've listened to Justice on loop at the gym the last two days, guys. I need, I need something else, so thank you to Stomp for bringing that. Um, that Stomp is going to... I, 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 I'm going to predict it now. They're going to be telling you, the ladies... Uh, in November, guys, they're going to be telling you to stomp or shout stomp with that song because that song's going to be an amazing. That song's going to be amazing with the crowd. Um, but yeah, really love the chorus, uh, love the verses too. But I won't lie, the pre-chorus and the bridge, favorite parts of the song, especially the pre-choruses. You, Yon and Jiu. Oh, absolutely. Even with just even before Jiu came into it, Yu Yon. Like, I was like, oh my god, this is probably already my favorite part of this song, and the bridge was stunning as well because the bridge, of course being very familiar to those pre-choruses as well. Uh, but honestly, the song kicks ass. The song kicks ass. Um, uh, Silver Fist Stomp is a great gym song. Oh, God. Yeah, I need I need something else than Justice to listen to in the gym. Although I'm not complaining if it is just Justice. Uh, the one Dong Lang is insane too. Uh, yeah, they, they're all... And, and it started Guyon's vocals right at the beginning too. The, uh, Guyon sounded amazing. Dammy's section. It's, it's dream catcher. It's, it's all great. But yeah, that was a really hyped track. Can't wait to listen to it again in the gym tomorrow. Um, but those pre-choruses, oh, wow, absolutely beautiful. And they were a great contrast to the to the hype banger that was the choruses and stuff. That song is going to be very good live, folks. Right. Okay, you've warned me enough. Two rings. We'll check out the official mix first. Because I want to hear the official mix and everything, of course, before before anything live. And then, of course, we'll check out the showcase version. Again, no clear of the sounds. So that's a, that's a way to start with our guitar. Oh, this has a groove. Guyon? 
I love this. Love that, that pace. It's so hard. Was that Tammy? There's a bit of growl there. This bridge, this bridge. Oh, you got to fade out of it. Is it fading out? Okay, it didn't fit up, but it was still cool. It was still cool. We'll get to that video in a moment, I suppose. Yeah, we'll we'll get to that video in a moment. Anyway, let's talk about the song first. Right, let's go in the chat. I'm gonna try not to look at try not to look at the screen for the moment meantime. <sighs> right. Okay, right, um Okay. Two rings, love areas, go go. Uh, Winter Chills, the growl, Shion did, so that was Shion that did the growl? Or was there two growls that I missed? Uh, Silver, Fist, uh, Silver Fist, giving Bike a rock. I have still got my hand up, guys, because I'm trying to block the screen, because I can't look at that just yet. I can't look at that just yet. Mm. I'm, why am I wearing a hoodie? That is, uh, the Dami growl, yes, I thought Dami growled. I thought Dami growled there. Uh, Lucy, I promise you, you are not ready for the choreo. There's choreography for that song. In those outfits. In, in 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 the outfits that I could see in my peripheral vision right now. Um, imagine Zayn, I really love the groove in this. Oh, it's so groovy. Such a groovy song. Uh, Weasdale, Game Changer. Uh, Daniel, this song is that song for me. Okay, so this is your favorite song off the album. Um, with the chills, there are no sub-vocalists in this group. Guyon, Guyon, I, I want to say, I want to shout out Guyon. Guyon is, whoa, I love the opportunities they've given Guyon in this EP. And she could always do it, but they've given her some real opportunities to showcase how awesome she is as a singer on this EP, which I think is brilliant. That's something I was thinking, actually, as that song was going on. Um, Daniel, he just saw the outfits. Yeah, he did. He did see the outfits. But let me just tell you, my alt isn't the only problem giving me problems. The only person giving me problems right now. And she give me problems. But let's just say I'm also holding some pain already. Um, did the elf just get hot? I says I'll like various. Uh, the last thing you get to lose me. Um, just so you know, that was the freeze, guys. No, it's just death. It's just death. Um, my Halania is my Halan is currently hiding in in, in a shell. Um, guy on bias is a read in this album. I'm, I'm sure, man. I'm sure. Oh God, I've gone through all the chat. You know, chat. If you wanna, if you wanna give me more stuff to read, so I. Could give my give myself a moment before I get to that. That'd be great. Uh, Ma Ma uh, only problem giving you problems. Mm. And now I'm holding this pain. Oh my God! Absolutely great. You know what I mean? Oh. 
What the fuck? <laughs> Not a wrecker, I'm getting wrecked but Don't you two stop. Oh my god. Yes, baby, yes. I love Dami's rap, by the way. I forgot to say that. What are you doing? What are you doing? No, what are you doing? What are you doing? No, what are you doing? What are you doing? I'm doing... A science. She said it, not me. She said it, not me. She said it. She said it, not me. The science. I'm doing the science. You yawn, you yawn top.
Is your fault, Yuya. Give a brother a break. Give a brother a break. I love this bit. Sue. Sue with, Sue with the hoop, hoop ear and Samurai Cross. Kimura. 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 How are you guys doing? You alright? Yeah, great to see you. Hello. I can't I can't watch back there, so I hope you're doing alright. Great, good. You gave- you warned me again, guys! It didn't matter! It didn't matter! <sighs> Chat. What are you saying? <sighs> Keep- oh, breathe. Oxygen, there you go. Keep up on YouTube, I'm pretty sure they let Handong choose the fits for video. I don't know what to say to that. Various, and I hope I'm pronouncing this right. Lorem ipsum sophalo shifalo shila good or shafi a sophia dollar sign. My Hallenia, let my know when might when it's safe. It never is. Silver face, hurry guys, don't say a word. Lad various, absi abs. Winter chills, ab catcher. Lad various, hand dong. Hand dong go away. <laughs> Daniel, hand dong go away. Lad various to you, 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 to Insane performance. Absolutely insane performance. I love the choreography. Their vocals, of course, sound incredible. I love that last section when they go back and forth. Oh, it's so good. I know Shion, of course, is the person that does it in the original song, so Yu Yeon was doing it here. I love that section. The, the whole song is a goddamn groovy banger, by the way. Um, but, yeah. It was a bit um, distracting at times. Uh, Andrea, I love the rainbow colours on the blonde hair. She pulls it off so well. Yeah, guy on, guy on, guy on, guy on. Do you know what I mean? Um, the I know they are. Uh, they're all stunning, but guy on my words, Labrarius. Uh, Silverface, it's so funny how they cut off the twerk with that camera angle. Like, we all know it was there. Yeah, there was a, yeah, I noticed the twerk. I noticed the twerk. Labrarius, don't you dare slow down. Uh, Winter Shells, Geo. Nope, 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 nope. Adverius, Kimbora, Silver Fist. I still can't believe after all of after all this, Fireflies is my favorite track. Can't take much more of this. Kimbora, holy <clears throat> winter chills. Kimbora, keep up in Utah. I think this is too. Uh, I think this is too make up for the very short scenes uh, we had at the end of OOTD when they lost the jackets. Luke's feet start having fun with them when Sue would throw it back. Uh, I think the laughing that you guys are doing is when I completely kind of lost my sanity uh, for a moment, which apologies for that, except I'm only human. Um, Andrea, I approved the scientific study. Yuyon said it. You know, Captain Jack and Barbosa, they were like, you know, they were asking the question. They were constantly asking the question. I was thinking the question myself. Yuyon said, I'm doing the science. I'm just following early. Just following early. Uh, Laveris, okay, guy, on just do as you want. Winter chills. I think I have never, ever, ever been more in love with them than I am right now. Kimbora is in dangerous mode, otherwise known as twenty four seven. Laveris, uh, Ice King James, hello, Ice King James. Uh, Winter chills. This is probably their best showcase video. Even beats proposed showcase for me. Can I just say as well? Obviously, they all looked incredible. I have a bit of a thing for hoop urines. I think they look amazing, like and everything like that. Kimbora. That's all I'd say to that. It's way too hot. That hoodie was getting unbearable at that point, guys. 
Um, absolutely unbearable. Uh, Lavarius' screen is the other one. <laughs> I had to see how they were doing, you know? I had to see how they were doing. It was nothing to do with the fact that I needed a bit of a break. Uh, Lavarius told you this EP is something else. Uh, this song is so cool. Yeah, it's got an amazing groove to it, man. Amazing groove. Oh, yeah, we have one song left. Now, I'm going to take a guess. It doesn't always happen like this. Dreamcatcher releases, when it comes to albums and, and EPs, tend to have the ballad at the end. So that would be my guess, that this is going to be a ballad. They don't always do it. There's a, there are exceptions. But I'm going to I'm going to take a guess that this... They do it most of the time, so I'm going to take a guess that this is going to be a ballad. Beautiful title, by the way, for the song. There you go. I know my dream catcher, folks. Oh, no, don't. Don't do it. Please don't do it. Don't do it. I've had enough of this stream. Don't. Be, be kind. to tearing up. That close to tearing up. 
Oh my god. Oh my god, man. Again, American insomnias. I am insanely jealous of what you're going to experience in November. I'm so happy for you. I'm so happy and not at all jealous, as Rachel and friends would say. Wow. Right. Mate, way too many glasses in these portraits, yeah. Yeah. Um, God. This one is dangerous in another way. Uh, Loose fee. Uh, Fireflies, aka Try Not to Cry Challenge. Difficulty Impossible at Silver Fist. Will Ross require tissues? <laughs> I don't think Ross requires a resurrection. That's the comment of the day, Andrea. Because it's just completely true. Um, the screen is up there. Yeah, I kind of melted a little bit for a while there. Sorry. Uh, hold on, I'll go find a cleric. Anyone got a diamond silver fist? Um, I was very close to melting on the floor, but I grabbed myself before, before I happened. Uh, Dan, I'll have to go, unfortunately, we'll, we'll be on Discord later. Keep Ross alive if you can. Uh, imagine saying this is my first time seeing the lyrics. Damn, winter chills. I never listened to ballads. This is the best one I've ever heard, and I will never skip this. Uh, the harmonies in this one. Oh my god, the harmonies on this one, Silver Fist. Winter chills, full body chills. Yep, and winter, I came from winter chills as well, so you know it's true. Uh, Labarius, my god, I miss them so much. Uh, Andrea, this is going to be a tear bring alive. Oh yeah, yeah. Winter chills, the she the she on falsetto. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go jump off the back. <laughs> Please don't though. With the chills, Ma Ma Halani has put up seven microphones, and I could not agree more. Um, Silver Fist, best dreamcatcher ballad. Period. Uh, Imagine Zane, dreamcatcher is the group that made me fall in love with ballads. This is their best one, I think. There you go. There's two agreements in in, in a row there. Um, Lucy, no tears because it's the first listen. The more you listen, the more I, I was very 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 close i will say that uh i i'm going to agree with silver fist imagine zane and i think winter setter as well this is dreamcatcher's best ballad i know i'm not a recent guys guy guys i'm not but i can comfortably say this is the best ballad in my opinion or at least my favorite um absolutely beautiful uh not only what they did vocally that's i don't think i've ever heard them harmonize that much on a song as well and they just proved again how it's just crazy how talented all seven of them are. The harmonies live are going to be incredible, man. Oh my god, the harmonies live are going to be incredible that time. It's where the harmonies were placed as well. But also the vocal melodies on the song um, was absolutely stunning. Stunning chorus, stunning verses. Um, they all sounded incredible. And again, I'm going to echo what I said. I'm so happy for Guyon. I'm so happy for Guyon. Don't get me wrong. And, uh, yeah, well, I'm so happy for Guyon. I want to say that because I really feel like they're giving her more opportunities, and she's she's delivering. Dami's singing near the start is the most beautiful singing I've ever heard her do. That's my like. I love when Dami sings. I love when she raps as well. Don't get me wrong. I love when she sings. That's the best. I've. That's the my favorite Dami singing section in the song. I. W blown away at the start so that already gave, that already gave me an idea of the danger that was coming um but the that, it, it wasn't just the harmonies it was the who they picked to put into the harmonies with each other and everything like that it just it just like i, I, I it, technical excellence you know technical i'm not a singer and stuff like that but i don't ha i don't understand i don't know if there is any singers in the chat but like i don't understand how if you if you're a singer and you hear that you must be pretty impressed what's being done there individually and together um uh but yeah i think that's and, and the instrumental the instrumental is completely my sound it's kind of got that like early 90s end credit song to it which i love i love that sound and if you got dreamcatcher doing that i mean come on come on man um so as i usually do guys um See, this isn't a ranking. We're not there yet. We've got some catching up to do. Uh, although we will be ranking a, a song a bit afterwards, if anybody's curious, because I will be doing an ultimate... Because I am going through enough pain on this stream. I will be doing an ultimate Dreamcatcher ranking episode live. Uh, if you know... if Vi Let's just say Vision was the last song, the last episode, so you may work out what the episode will be, the song will be, I will say. It's a pretty well-loved song by Insomnia, so that's going to be interesting to rank. Um, 
But I like to say with all album parties, I like to pick the, my favorite song off the album. Now, I didn't need to do that with Idol earlier because, of course, I was ranking anyway. Um, Just This is my favorite song off the album. But I am absolutely overjoyed to say that all those B-sides are excellent. Uh, it's just the fact that I think, like I said with Justice, Justice isn't, in my opinion, one of my favorite title tracks from Dreamcatcher. It's one of my favorite songs, period. And it's going to be a to rank in, uh, what is it, a few weeks or, or, or a, uh, a couple of months' time uh, when, when, of course, I'm, I'm doing it. And um, the B-sides, they were all, like, great in their own way, so individual to each other while still feeling like they're on this release. The, again, best intro from Dreamcatcher, I think. I think that's fair to say. Um, which is saying something, because their intros are always incredible. Um, but Justice, for me, is 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 a masterpiece from the off. It's an instant masterpiece. Um, it is my favourite off the album, but that is no slight whatsoever to the other songs. If you're curious what my favourite B-side is, well, this. This is my favourite B-side off the album. Uh, this is my favourite B-side off the album. Um absolutely blew me away which is saying something because the others blew me away for different reasons different reasons but this is this is their best ballad i think so that's got to come for something like you know got to come for something um right okay catch up with the chat a little bit uh and they do have amazing ballads absolutely they do absolutely they do uh winter chills the shadow slow version counters ballad oh that's a good question winter chills that's a good question i've never actually thought of that um Matt Helene, I got home from 12 hours, plus I was in shift in time for this. Oh, but now it's, t it's past my, my bedtime, so no problem, Matt Helene. Thanks for joining. Um, and have a good night. Excuse me, Andrea. For me, album order is Justice, Fireflies, similar to me, uh, Two Rings, Stomp. I don't know about Two Rings and Stomp, but I'll wait till we rank uh, in, in, when we get some for that. But uh, I, could t I could tell you Fireflies is my favourite song at this point on, on the B from the B-sides. Um, but all within top 20 of all Dreamcatcher songs we've already, wow, Justice and Fireflies are up there with the top 5 and that's saying something I can believe it, to be honest, I can believe it uh, Imagine Zane, is there a list of all the previous uh, requests, I was thinking of requesting the three of all songs, so I'm not really sure how to do so, uh, Lab Various can help you out with that, Imagine Zane um, Winter Chills, this is one of their best EPs ever from the top of my head only from us tops it for me honestly, like, again, I'm talking out of bias when I say this I, they're my favorite. They're my favorite group in K-pop. They're one of my favorite groups in any music genre ever. Probably, in, yeah, it's com comfortably top three favorite groups of all time for me. And I'm someone who, as you can probably tell, loves music. Lots of genres of music across the world. Um, and I've been listening passionately to music in different genres for decades and decades and decades. But yes, they are without a doubt in that top three, without a doubt. I mean, you know what I mean? Come on. Um, but I will say this is, I don't know about one of the best, honestly, and that's no, no shade to this. It's just they have such amazing EPs, but I'll need some more time with it. But it's an incredible EP. So it's just when you put it next to the others, you know, 